In this video we'll briefly discuss what is Clopidogrel, grill. How it works, what it's used for, the dose and side effects, contraindications and precautions. Clopidogrel is an antiplatelet agent. The active metabolite of Clopidogrel selectively inhibits the binding of adenosine diphosphate to its platelet receptor and the subsequent adenosine diphosphate mediated activation of the glycoprotein 2B and 3A complex, thereby inhibiting platelet aggregation. And this action is irreversible. It is available as 75 mg tablets. Clopidogrel is used to prevent heart attacks and strokes in persons with heart disease, recent heart attack, recent stroke, or blood circulation disease, peripheral vascular disease. It is also used with aspirin to treat new or worsening chest pain, such as new heart attack or unstable angina, and to keep blood vessels open and prevent blood clots after certain procedures, such as cardiac stent. The usual dosage of clopidogrel for recent myocardial infarction, recent stroke, or established peripheral arterial disease, is 75 mg once daily. And for acute coronary syndrome, such as unstable angina, start with a 300 mg loading dose, then continue at 75 mg once daily. Initiating and continuing aspirin, 75 to 325 mg per day, in combination with clopidogrel. It is contraindicated in case of hypersensitivity to the drug, and active pathological bleeding, such as peptic ulcer, or intracranial hemorrhage. Common adverse effects include, upper respiratory tract infection, chest pain, headache, flu-like syndrome arthralgia, dizziness, diarrhea, rash, rhinitis, and urinary tract infection. Advise patients that each dose may be taken without regard to meals. Inform patients that it may take longer than usual to stop bleeding while taking this drug and to report unusual bleeding or bruising to healthcare provider. Advise patients to inform healthcare provider about the use of this drug before undergoing surgical or dental procedures, and before any new drug is taken. Advise patients not to take any prescription, or over-the-counter medication or dietary supplements, unless advised by health care provider. And advise patients that follow-up visits and laboratory tests may be required, to monitor therapy. That's all for this video. Subscribe and click on the bell icon for more animated medical videos like this one.